So what is up bosses, it's your boy Boss Fat One and welcome back to Life is Strange 2. We're going to hopefully finish off episode 4 which is called of course Faith in this episode. So we've just got to I believe our mum's house. We've just had a shower for pretty much the first time since the first episode of episode 1 which here we go. Can we skip this though I wonder because we've already seen this. Okay I guess not. I guess let, let's just talk through this. So in the last episode we met up with Daniel. He was in a church and we got kicked out and were threatened by a gun so we could have easily died i think we got punched or yeah we got kicked in the head and we got punched in the last episode so that's why we have all of these freaking bruises i mean it seems like we got shot three times i mean we might as well have to be fair and obviously we still got the eye patch on which i thought was on the other eye or maybe it was on the left eye yeah i'm pretty sure it was, was on the left eye i assume anyway hopefully i wasn't just randomly freaking changed that'll be weird even have water on his body that's freaking awesome. Here we go. We're about to get changed into other clothes. And hopefully in this episode, as I said at the end of the last one, hopefully we're going to find out why we dislike our mum. Because obviously she said sooner or later we're going to have to talk. So maybe that's going to happen in this video. I mean, surely it has to happen in this video. Because after this video, all that will be left is whether I'm going to do a, a bonus episode for this one or not. Which probably not actually because I've got a lot of other games to catch up on. So it's just going to be whatever happens in episode 5, and then that'll be the freaking end. So, potentially after this one, only three, possibly four more episodes for clean the pain away, but Life is Strange. That felt good. Alright, let's do this. Once again, I'm a bit tight on time, so I apologise if I'm rushing things a bit, but my god, this game looks amazing. Karen? Wonder where how are you? Karen has been here. Let's have a look over this stuff. So Karen did check it out. Okay, so we've already read that. She saw Daniel in action. Yeah, so Karen was there then. Kind of pretty. Keychain. Maybe this is collectible, possibly. she made it. Is it a collectible? Okay, it's not. Karen's bag. I oh, should we be doing this? Peak, but... Hmm. What a notebook. Damn. Okay. Karen does like to capture the world around her. Tracing close at every mile, my heart goes racing. Sore, I remember. Know the feeling. There's no fighting back that being tearing apart. My core. Early morning blues, coffee, red eye truckers and sad families. Bad eggs. Not the waitress not the waitress's fault. She is a quick, hurried one. Probably ending a long night shift. Okay, that goes down too much. Tag says Clementine, twenty two ish from freaking Walking Dead. Redhead dyed brunette. Eyebrows and skin tone don't lie. Irish decent, like Jack Septiguy. Owner's daughter maybe. M M Mahoney's, is, is that how you pronounce it? I have no idea. Vague, polite smile, busy mind, mildly clumsy. Mildly clumsy, looks distracted, anxious. Young cook called Clemmy, brother, boyfriend, boyfriend. Apologises when the orders are late and she's the only one getting roasted. Do mum and dad know you're dating on the job, Clemmy? Mixing up work and love seldom makes a good match. The, uh, that a brand new baby bump under the stained apron? It's 2017 and young folks are still busy making babies. I guess nothing ever really changes. Okay, I didn't really freaking understand that as I'm from Kent yeah, and we don't freaking speak like that, but let's just continue on anyway. Red M Mahoney's build a boulder city in Nevada. I don't know what that says. Apple pie, red chicory coffee, total weight 95. Okay, great. I've just read a freaking bill, and that's just condoms in there. We don't have to look at that. We all know what that freaking is already. Got a roadmap. This just... Way too big. It sure freaking is, bro. You're in the, the biggest country in the world, I'm pretty sure. Actually, no, I think it's like the third biggest. Karen was always phone. into low tech. I hmm. even think it's the one she had back then. Probably, yeah. We've come a long, sweater. long way, buddy. I guess that's our freaking squad sweater. Hell yes, and our backpack this is thing here. is killing my back. So we've got three. Actually, no, four. Yeah, we got four of the six. That's not bad, actually. I think we've got these three at the top here, and then this one. And I think these two, as they're just pictures of something, it's just that we haven't yet got them. So that's not bad. We got four out of six for now, and possibly the other two we haven't actually got to yet, which would be freaking awesome. I didn't mean to click that. I just freaking left-clicked randomly, and I picked up something. So that was interesting. Be right back. What's this say? We'll find out. Popped out for supplies. I'll grab some food in case you want to eat. New socks and shorts in the bathroom. All yours if they fit. Might be a good time to contact Jacob. His number is on the letter he sent. Be right back. Karen. Yeah, so she said that she spoke with um, Jacob, if I remember correctly. 
got a tablet here huh. as well. This is another tablet. Struggles with too many open apps, but should be okay for basic browsing. Oh, here we go. Basic browsing slash ge geolocate, geolocat, wherever that is. Password is 112708. Hope you find your son. So 112708. Hey, Freaking technology. hell yes. My Super god. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to look through this. Probably not going to read it. So a, sign, it's a, a slice like of a Haven point. And then just reviews but for hotels. <laughs> Hot Dog Man there. Mustard Party 2 play now. Hell yes. Next freaking series on the channel. Hell yes. Curtain, look this outside. This is quite remote. So it isn't a motel at the moment. I guess that's the review for this motel. Freaking two stars. Why are we here? Draw. Lovely. Get some fresh light in the area, why not? So not living like a freaking vampire the entire game. To be fair, we have been outside most of the game. Oh, there's a drawing area. Awesome. Could have easily freaking missed that as I didn't actually say it's a drawing area. Wonderful. I didn't actually okay. check to see how many Destroyed. we've missed or how many Don't we've got anything else. yet. I might do that after this, actually. This might be the last one. You never know. There Can't we go. Lovely. So really that's, I guess, the entire ahead. part. Or maybe, yeah, I think that's the entire part. And then just more details at this point. Freaking wonderful. Why do we look upset? <laughs> Are we upset with the drawing? I can keep going. Add more details on the cars and the scenery and everything. Freaking lovely. Then over this way. In the pool after a long ride. There's this going to be one where we just draw... Where we have two options to draw extra stuff as well. It's so last time we drew hell, if I remember correctly. Even more details. Okay. That's not there, way. but that's it's in so the picture now. Oh, hell yes. That is freaking Huge. awesome. Alright, back to reality, dude. Lovely. Awesome. Where is Karen, though? I have no idea. I guess do we leave now? I'm not going out. Not going out? Never mind. Better We're not going out, not staying here. in. Just hanging around with our head in the spin. There's no reason to scream or shout. We're not going out. Great. I'm surprised I actually remember that song. What do we have in here? Casino I token. What happened with Finn. So that's another collectible. Or maybe that's that white collectible, like the circle. Maybe I didn't have that yet then. Let's check, actually. Open backpack. Oh no, that is another one. So we got one more to get. Hell yes. And then how do we look at the... Drawings. Is this from just this one? No, it's not. So that's one, two three that we've got on this one. I can't see how many we need though. Hmm. Okay, cool. So we've got three. We've got three drawings in this episode. That's all we know. Um, it's got a drawer. We looked in their phone. That's probably something. Oh, Holy Bible. We'll look at that first. Never mind. I can't. Karen said she left me Jacob's number somewhere. Oh yeah, she did. Is it on this? Karen's note. Oh, Jacob's letter. I didn't actually read this. Jeez. There we go. It only uh, took Supermom eight years to give a shit. <laughs> Dear Miss Diaz, my name is Jacob and I worked with your son Sean and Daniel on a farm in California. There were some problems and Sean went missing. I'm with Daniel now in Haven Point, Nevada. He gave me this PO box address, so if you get this, I think Daniel might be in danger. He needs help to get out of here. I can tell you more if you contact me at this number. 775-555-0118. Please hurry. Thank you, Jacob. Lovely. Hopefully I don't need to remember that number. So I guess now do we just immediately phone? Okay, cool, Jacob. Cool. I guess Sean has a better freaking memory than I do. I mean, he's a video game character, so it's likely. A wireless phone that's like that? Jacob, it's me. I've never seen that Sean. before. Sean? No way. I've been waiting to hear from you for months. Yeah. So this is the guy that um, plays the guitar, yourself. isn't it? If I remember correctly. I know. I'm not far. In a motel. Good. Listen, I, I can't talk right now. I gotta go. Wait, Daniel. 
How's he doing? Meet me tomorrow afternoon on Brady Highway. There's a, a, a junction just above Haven Point. So he was there. We didn't see him though. Billboard there. I'll be there at four. Jacob, wait. I can't talk, Sean. Be there tomorrow, please. I kind of wanted to cut to Jacob now, but I know the game likes to stay in the perspective of Sean. Damn. Okay. He couldn't really talk. Well then. Wait, bed. Oh, this is so messed up. I wait for Karen. Here we go. Freaking lovely. So Karen's gone somewhere then. I didn't even know let's she'd just left. Let's rest while I wait for her. Alright, let's do it. If she comes back. There's a question, yeah. There we go. It fades to black. And then we get a knocking on the door. By hopefully not the police. Okay, hey. good. Sorry it took so long. The fucking store was packed. How you feeling? Nothing broken? Altar boys don't fight fair? Yeah. I'm okay. Double cheese, no onion. Oh, right? hell yes. I mean, no onion's a bit questionable, but double cheese? Yes, freaking McDonald's double That'll cheeseburger. There is a chair there, by the way. And, uh, antibacteria stuff for your eye. Well, that takes me back to freaking hey, dying we'll light days. Down. Or at least take a breath. <sighs> like you care. Sean, I do. <sighs> Come on, Karen. Don't act all hurt. It's too late. Where were you when I broke my leg when I was 13? Not with me. When Daniel got a bad flu a couple of years ago. Yeah, that's a bit Just like, you breaking your legs are just a bit worse than a freaking flu, you? isn't it? Where were you? Fair I enough. mean, now, bro, you got a freaking so bit of glass talk, in your eye. Because we do have to get your brother out of a cult. I'm listening. How did you two survive alone on the road for that long? Hey, that's the name of episode one. Um, oh, we could say dad taught us. You technically did. Dad taught me responsibility. He always wanted I say he technically did. He, he did, without the technically part. Good. We've known that from all the How flashbacks and everything. Beaver Creek? And he you was a freaking awesome character. Right? You're right. So tell me what you want from me, Sean. Nothing, Karen. I mean, what do you want from me? A fucking it is true. Hey. I just want you to know what I did, and why, if you care. So, ask me anything. Um, why did you leave? All right. Why did you bail on us? I wasn't meant to be a wife or a mother. I thought I was supposed to. I tried to pretend for many years. I wasn't happy, and the urge to leave just became unbearable. I had no other choice. Are you serious? You chose this life. You fell in love. You made your own choices, right? Making your own choices doesn't mean you can never fool yourself, Sean. After I had Daniel, you were about eight, and Esteban's garage was getting busy. There was so much going on around me, yet somehow I just felt that my own life was just slipping away. Felt like an empty shell. Sean, it was the hardest decision I ever made. I knew I might never see you all again, but I took that responsibility. Uh, oh, I can't do the other one. Um, Dad Did knew? Did Dad know about all of this? I was honest with your father. We I guess she knows that he's dead. It wasn't about him. It was me. Um, let's not just say that. Let's just say he was he heartbroken. Was heartbroken for we don't want to be completely life. mean about the situation. Years. I was too. I was in love with your father. He was the best person I ever met. But just not enough for you. 
Something was missing from the equation, yeah. I was. Hmm. Well, you do. Okay, we do answer this So, what exactly this one as well. are you doing in Nevada? You live around here? No. I'm uh, way out in Arizona. Sean, I told you. Your friend uh, Jacob wrote my P.O. box and said Daniel was in trouble. That's it. Um, Arizona? Arizona? Holy shit. It's just lizards and rocks. Yes, I found something there. New York didn't really do me good, so. Yeah, okay. Think I've heard enough. I didn't have a choice, Sean. We only have one life, and I didn't want mine to be spent in regrets. For years, I fooled myself, thinking I'd find satisfaction into what society expected me to be, and that was my mistake. I hope someday you can understand that. But I never stopped caring about you. For what it's worth, I am sorry for hurting you and Daniel and Esteban. Um, I know. I know you are, Karen. The source of forgiveness it still doesn't change is the in the air now. Of course not. At least we've calmed down a bit. I know I can't change the past, Sean. I don't think you would. I need some air. Hmm. Never mind. I regret what I just freaking said. I'm saving at least. We went the nicest route we could, I believe. This would have been a better area to have the sketch, actually. Because we're actually outside this time. So I don't have the tint of the window getting in the way of the details. There's an office over there on the left. Them water physics are freaking nice. Like all the reflections and everything. Sean, whatever you want to say to me, this is the time. Let's just do we get a choice? Get it all out in the open. See what happens. Um Did you miss us? So, did you ever actually miss us? Or dad? Of course, Sean. I do miss your father. He had such a big heart. He could brighten up a rainy day. That was like his superpower. But above all, I missed watching you grow up. See how you saw the world. I missed sharing these moments with you, Sean. Hmm. We used to do we used so to much. Be so much stuff. Like when you taught me to ride because Dad sucked. Or when we went camping near Vancouver. Just me and you. You always loved night skies. I did stargaze a lot when I was in California. Trust me, the further south you go, the better it gets. Um... These two, I kind of want to answer, but I don't want to get on the bad side. Not why ghost us, what did you do? But I still feel like that's going to be a bad one. So what did you do when you left? Okay, it seems to be go? good. I pursued. I thought it was gonna be. I was gonna scream. What did you do? Like, why did you leave Learned us and stuff lesson. like that? But it's gone the good route. I, guess I feel like why ghost us I isn't really one that I should on that I should ask. Which doesn't involve a husband and two kids. It does to a lot of people, and I totally respect that. Just not to me. I wasn't good at making plans, which is what most of modern life is about, right? School. Job, marriage, ask my mom and dad. They wanted me to follow their rules, their faith. That's the name of episode tried, two. <laughs> but I wanted to find my own way with no security blanket. Are you going to say wasteland yeah, as well so we can religion, get the freaking trio? Social norms. It's just all about security, after all. But it all just looked like a sweet golden jail to me. I tried to escape that. Hmm. Worth it? Yeah. Hope it was worth it. 
It was. That was the freaking lose lose now, situation, but I found my that was a better one. World with like minded people. I'm at peace with my fuck ups and my decisions. Is that bird ever gonna move? It's been there for the whole freaking time. Peace. How do you make peace with Bailey? Thanks for watching parents, and peace. <laughs> your husband and your kids. I know, that's hard to understand. But I think people should know who they are. And not fake it for anybody. I'm gonna do this one. I don't wanna ask the other one. <sighs> Whatever. You sound so careless. It's like you can't even realize how much pain you've caused. I do care. That's why I'm here. To help you and your brother. If I didn't step up to help him now, I couldn't live with myself. Was that? Oh, of course. Hmm. If we'll either do this one, we're gonna gain a bond. Hey, so I'm gonna do it. Um, mind if I bum a smoke? Sure. Still got a few left. She's not questioning that we smoke. Okay, that's a good sign. I mean, it's a bad sign for a parent, but it's a good sign for our bonding. Wow. I haven't seen that lighter in ages. Your dad loved that thing. Oh, so he, she already knew then. Or was that Dad's, Only maybe? I have left of his. Oh, yeah, it was Dad's. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, we've had that since freaking beginning. Oh, man. Esteban hated when I smoked. He didn't want me to die an early death. Fuck. Life can be so cynical sometimes. I remember he would smoke sometimes. Long ago. We didn't fight much, but when we did, I would go out on the porch and light up so I could calm down. Esteban would come over and ask for a drag. And then we'd just look up at the sky and watch the stars or the planes. I do miss that. I used to do the same thing with my best friend, Lila. Smoking on the porch, just letting time go. That's when you know someone is good to you. When you can just. Where's that sound? Is that just the water? Shut the hell up and watch the universe do its own thing. Yeah, there we go. Sand. What does that say? Sand something motel. Sand snake motel? Or something we should like go that? Back I have inside. no idea. Let's go back to the side. I gotta change this dressing. Okay. Let's go. Sean, I know I can't change the past. Or what I did. But this is about helping your brother. You gotta trust me this one time. I know. I know. It's still hard. But yes. We have to be a team to rescue Daniel. We can do it. Okay. How? We, need we have to, to call Jacob in the Jacob. morning, I guess, yeah, exactly what more than us about Karen just said. Well, I called him when you were out. We can meet with him tomorrow. Okay, good. I also got these, just in case. Hmm, cool. Okay. Better take we should got, like, Star Wars ones or something to be so cool, not just boring black ones. need any help with that? I used to have them, like, two clones. That was freaking awesome. Oh, yeah, yes. sure, why not? I hate it when he does yes. it himself anyway, so, so please have someone do it for you him. feel like telling me the story here? That's something I haven't and thought I about. Time. Like, should we tell Karen about Daniel's power? 
when I usually have, especially with Life is Strange, I'm usually right with who I trust and who I don't trust. And I kind of trust Karen in a weird way. We've had this idea of her for the entire game that like we don't like her because she's been this evil person that we know that she's left um, Sean and Daniel at a young age. I guess she left when Daniel was born and she said that it was too much for her and she'd left. So she left when Sean was eight. So that means we're either 17 or 18. So either my age or my age in two months, three months or something like that. I don't know. I, I can't be bothered to do the maths. Yeah, it's quite interesting that now... I mean, I knew a hundred, literally a million percent that she was going to be in at least one episode, but... Here, try this on. Just like every other game and series that has this in, she's trying to get our trust. And usually it turns out good. So I'm, I'm going to trust her. Oh, hell How yes. Great. Bringing back freaking Max and Thank Chloe's you. pirate adventures. Big day tomorrow. So we should get some rest. Yeah. I'm ready to get Daniel. Let's do it. Or fade to black. That was a cool transition, to be fair. But I guess now are we going into the final part of the chapter, possibly? I have no idea. Meeting point. The next day. I kind of feel like this would be a good way to end it. Getting Daniel... And hopefully meeting up with, um, what's his name? I can't even remember his freaking name now. Yeah, it's gone. It's, it's freaking gone. As soon as it's gone, that's it. It's gone for at least another seven years, or at least until we see the character. Sure he's going to show up? He better. He promised. Does it really help me forgetting his name well, if he, he keeps saying he? Us. We'll find him. I can't believe how much crap you guys have been through. Makes me want to punch in the face each and every asshole that got in your way. Yeah. I want to. Good thing we got to meet amazing people, too. Life on the road is all about that. The sweet encounters. Hope I can see them again someday. Oh, you will. So tell me about Daniel. What's he like? Um. Oh, if we say he's special, that might be... Well, he's hmm. definitely special hope so he's your brother right okay never mind it's up i thought it was gonna be because he has power so if we say he's special then that maybe him? that would be a hint yep. wait here because we don't know if it runs in the family we don't know whether it's daniel's the first one that had these quote-unquote powers that we know of sean what um can you explain? Jake, I'm not mad, but Ooh, you Jake. better explain everything. I didn't know where else to go. Listen, I, I saw Daniel come back to the camp that night. Like, he was in shock or something. Then I heard all these sirens, and I got scared. I just, I packed a few things, I, I took a blanket from your tent, and we, we left together. I also kept the cash you made on the farm. Uh, it's... In my car. You did right. You did right, Jake. Thank you. It's better than just leaving it no there, isn't it? What he looked like when I found him that night, Sean. He was in bad shape, with a gunshot wound, and all by himself. I, I. Oh yeah, he I got shot, didn't just he? Leave him there. Um. What about the others? Uh, what about the others? No, one of them's Anna, in the Cassidy, in Penny. the um what hospital. Happened to them. They ran over to Merrill's place when they found out Finn was gone. That was the last time I saw them. Oh, then no. on their way out here, Daniel told me more about what happened that night. How scared he was. The blast. We all were. The freaking Merrill guy had a shotgun. Himself he had a shotty. For what he did. I need to get to him, Jacob. I'm the asshole who went along with the robbery. I'm telling you to be careful with the Reverend Mother. She's waited her whole life for somebody like Daniel. The Reverend knows how to manipulate people. She's yeah, she sure freaking does. 
Not us, though. We're too powerful. To with her. Daniel has faith in the Reverend now. Um, I'm not yeah, freaking afraid I'm of afraid her. Of that Elizabeth of yours. I'm getting Daniel out of here. Uh, come on. We're going to Mexico. There's no way they're gonna let you take him away. Well, too bad. We're not gonna ask for their permission. You must be Jacob. I'm Karen. Hi. Okay. Somewhat, he looks different. You do this. Now, when he went out of the car, I, I didn't actually recognize him. I think school must be over by now, but Lisbeth will stay at the church with Daniel for his special classes. That'll give us time to sneak into the compound before we get to them. Hell yes. I'll be on the lookout. Keep watch in case it all goes to shit. Sean, stay on the walkie. Sounds like a plan. One more thing. I, uh, we have to get my sister too. Sarah. Oh yeah. Really, Jacob? Come on, man. She's with your parents. I know. Please, listen, Sean. She's sick. She's not safe here. She's sick. They believe yep. in everything Elizabeth says. And she says she'll cure Sarah with prayers. I know you understand. Not freaking up in him. Right? Damn, Jake. We need his help too, Sean. Okay, Jake. Okay, good. I'm, I'm glad that wasn't an option because that's just something we Sarah should Lee. do anyway. We just, we need to find her medical record. I think it's in her home office. Then I'll go get Sarah Lee while you get Daniel. Okay? Fine. Sure. I'm going to trust you on this, Jacob. All good for you, Karen. What if Daniel won't go with you? Well, we know he's not going to go with us. I know. We know Sarah's not going to go with us, but... I mean, all we need is Karen to pop out, and then maybe he'll change his mind, or maybe he'll not recognise her or something. As she said, she left when he was born. So the chance of him recognising Karen is about freaking 1%. For all he knows, he could have already seen Mum at some point in the in the last few episodes. He just didn't realise that it was her. Karen? I'm in place. I can see the whole camp. Let me know if you need anything. Be careful, Sean. Got it. Thanks. We gotta be careful now. If anything happens, let me do the talking, okay? Yeah, of course. Okay, let's do this. Let's get this. Go on, on a freaking heist. Let's do it. GTA 5 heist let's in the freaking making. Right behind the church. So, in and out. Why can't okay. I run? And you sure Lisbeth will have those files on your sister? Watch out, Sean. There are people right outside. Oh, shit. Are there? How many? I don't think I can crouch. Oh, it's him. Thanks. Oh, no. People aren't supposed to come and go around the church once the service is over. Better to avoid them if we can. Okay, this is where we go then. I think that's the guy that punched me. Okay, Karen. Call Karen with your walkie-talkie by holding Q. And that one. Karen. Everything alright? Yeah, don't worry about me. Who is that? Cool. Be careful, though. You never know. Thanks, Sean. I will. I don't know who this is. Oh, come on. Hello, young Hackerman. What are you doing here? Oh, uh, hi. We're just... You know you're not supposed to wander around the church once the service is over, right? Right, I, I, I'm sorry, but we, we were just, uh... Show me around. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. This is my first time at your church, so... He was just showing me around. It's always a pleasure to welcome new members. Lovely. How come I didn't see you at the surface, though? I know, I know. Because I wasn't late, there. So, we just, uh, watched from upstairs. Bro, you can't just say, uh, all the time. You don't have to lie. 
everybody exactly attending services. Uh, if you say uh all the time, she's gonna think you're freaking Listen, lying, aren't you? I should know. I'm okay. the king of freaking lying. I used to be anyway. Sure. Absolute freaking king. If you say you. uh more than like once or twice, then that they just instantly think you're lying. You're like uh, and every time you say uh, you're trying to think of what to say. Hence, when they play them games of like continuously saying a word and make it Jeez. a word. If you say uh or ah uh, or whatever like that, then you fail she seem to because like you're trying to freaking much. think of what to say. That's because I left the church. Always come prepared of what you're gonna say before you freaking do any of this. Sorry to hear that. Well, I think this is where, you go, where, where you're going, where we're going here. This is where you guys are going here. You, really you, the viewers, are going in this house. area, apparently. Okay. I just, I hope they're not onto us. Oh, of a tree. Let's haul ass. Where are the files? Right there, in her office. Ugh. Of course it's locked. If only we are done, you. Just another lie. We gotta find a way in. Fuck. Think there's a key somewhere? Maybe she's too cautious not to have a spare set around. Hmm. Very much doubt it. Yes, I wanted to have a look at Sean's face or Sean's Whoa. back of his head. Thank you very much. Chores list. Cleansiness is next to godliness. Hmm. Are you okay. okay, Jake? Make bed every yeah. morning. I guess that means no, it's like knee it up, not just change the sheets. So full of memories and stuff. Fire extinguisher. Looking for somewhere for a key. We got a lot this of pills here. Lot of pills. Especially for some. This is a lot. Okay, didn't mean to do that. Especially for someone who doesn't believe in science. Hmm. Daniel's haircut makes much more sense now. Yeah, I was gonna say. I mean, last time I said he's actually managed to gain hair rather than freaking lose hair, which is the opposite of what you're meant to do. Did she teach Daniel how to play this? Hmm. Is this where Daniel's been staying then, I guess? Well, this one isn't locked. Is this Daniel's room? Yeah. Man. It's depressing. Mm. Well, Elizabeth doesn't believe in material possessions, so... Doesn't mean you need to decorate your house like a prison. Okay, let's have a look at this stuff. Oh, shit. Dearest Daniel, I know you may never read this, but I had to reach out after witnessing your Holy Spirit last so week. I'm a sinner. I have been a church-going woman for years, but I heard a lot of, but I heard a story from my neighbour about Elizabeth Fish and your miracles. I could feel the Lord whisper to me, and when I drove all the way from Truckee to Haven Point, and I saw your angel face, I knew my faith was coming back. You showed us that God is alive and working through Daniel. <clears throat> You raised the cross like he raised Jesus. I found my faith against and am, and am more strong than ever. You were sent to prove that God's love is real. I'm, I am saving money to see you again and pray I can be of service forever. Your servant, Laurie Conway. P.S. If you want to talk, here is my number. 208 freaking 6 Lovely. Okay. Uh, Jacob? Um... Jacob, you've kind of freaking trapped me here, bro. Okay, there we go. I was very freaking worried then. I literally was trapped then. Finn's bracelet. No matter what happened, I guess Finn was a real friend to Daniel. Hell yeah. Oh, we got a secret drawing. <laughs> They're so cute. Lovely. So that's Sarah. We'll pick up. So another collectible. Oh, hell yes! I have got all the freaking collectibles! Like an absolute boss! It says that I don't have all of them, though, for some reason. Oh, yeah, I forgot I can actually equip them. Yeah, I don't really know what that does, but whatever, that's fine. The drawing's here as well. This is quite the change from Power Bear and Friends. Yeah. Freaking brainwash him into liking something he didn't even know about. <sighs> of course. So we gotta find a key somewhere. Right in here. Only one jumper. Freaking course. Simon. Is she forcing him to do this? Why is he accepting all that? Okay. This is quite strange actually. He looks happy. Fuck. Nice picture. 
I can't believe I missed it. Happy Boy. birthday, Daniel. Hmm. Sean, is everything all right in there? <sighs> yes. Not finding anything. We're trying to get into her office. What is this? Daniel Fisher? Hmm. Oh no. <sighs> yes. Oh, of course. We're trying to get into her office. She's locked it up, so it has to be there. Fine. I'll let you know if I see anything unusual. <sighs> Got it. It's gotta be in here somewhere then. Let's look over here first. Drawers. Search. <sighs> Nothing here. There's nothing on that one. There's got to be somewhere here then. Whoa! They kicked okay, her out of game. church. Now they're thirsty. Dear Reverend Fisher, this is Michael Bloom, and I know it's been a long time since we last talked, and I know that our talk was not a happy one. Despite our differences, we all know that you were a de uh, a devout spirit and to be reckoned with. Nobody has been surprised by your words and deeds touching so many people. Hope you believed it when I say we are all proud of you. We are also sorry and ashamed for asking you to leave the church without understanding the power of your faith. As we need to remind ourselves, mistakes can be life lessons. Even prideful deacons should be humbled before the Lord's wisdom. We hope you find it in your heart to forgive us and we would be honoured to host you for a visit anytime you wish. Bless you, Michael. Okay, great. Lovely. So it's this drawer as well. Don't see anything of interest. Nothing. Okay, is it literally going to be the last freaking drawer that I search? Well, that oh, looks shit. like something. Looks like the Reverend Mother got to this letter before Jake. Jacob, thank you so much for telling me about Daniel. I'm on my way to Heaven Point now, and please let Daniel know. Without we're, without getting him or you in trouble, that his family has not forgotten him. I don't know where Sean is, and I hope we can find him too. Hope the best for you, and if you need anything, do not hesitate to ask for help. I'm there. Take care. Karen. Okay, I think I read that before, so I apologise if I did. Another drawing here. What a great fucking family portrait. <laughs> Lovely. It says call Karen again, so let's do that. Hey, I found your letter for Jacob. Too bad Lisbeth found it first. She took it from the mail? Damn that woman. Yeah, she checks mm. everything that comes and goes into the community. Fair enough. Okay. This is the last drawer in here. The... She's completely obsessed with his power. Daniel try Daniel tired after using gift. Nothing gives him energy after. New diet. He acts on his own. Scripture won't impel him. More prayer, more study. Daniel pooty today after lesson or pouty. Spare the road and spoil the child. Not yet must show grace. Trust in the Lord. I did cry today watching the miracles. The child must be a vessel. What will he deliver unto us and when? Okay. Great. I freaking understand that. The window. Nice prison view, dude. Yeah, great. Where is the freaking key then? Oh, there's another drawer here. Ah, there we freaking go. Of course. The last freaking drawer. Lovely. Okay. I found a key. Good. Let's try it. This one might be for both of the doors. So let's potentially go to this one. So then it's only Daniel that's likely to see us if he arrives here again. I don't know where he is at the moment. Oh, shit. Maybe it opens the other door. Okay, never mind. We have to go to the other door anyway. Alright, we can kind of fast walk a bit. So that's freaking wonderful, I guess. Should be this door here. Must Look at it first, it. apparently. There we go. So we could break it if we wanted to, but we have the key, so there's no point. Yes. Or we. Okay, there we That's go. The cool. Doesn't <sighs> usually take me that long to open a door with a key, but never mind. Whoa. Is this her personal archive or something? Yeah. She keeps track of everything in here. Stuff about my sister must be in this one. Okay, I've got something. Must be what you're looking for. Damn. She has pneumonia? And for what I get, Lisbeth knows damn well she needs medical treatment. That's She's not doing it. She's insane. 
That's exactly what I've been saying, especially Look, with Daniel. She has a file on you too. <laughs> you can take a peek and see how she really treats her flock. Man, what's all this? Were you like sick? Conversion therapy? Do they <sighs> wanted to cure you from being? <sighs> Pretty much. I always showed more interest in boys than girls. Oh. <laughs> they thought I was a freak. A sinner. Okay. Tell, Tell your you... parents? Tell your parents? <laughs> you kidding? <laughs> they wanted her to do that. Mom and Dad thought I had a demon inside. So did I. I really did believe I was a sinner, so I thought I had to atone for my sins. How did that go? And, uh, how did that go? Not good. I just prayed all the time and stopped hanging out with boys, girls, everybody. I got depressed, paranoid. Damn, Jake. After a few years, I was in a really bad place. I, I tried to hurt myself. Elizabeth was very upset. We had a long chat. She told me I should leave. Go see the world and figure things out. I, I don't really get her, Sean. But Elizabeth does believe in all of this stuff. I had no clue about your life here. I'm... I'm sorry, Jake. I'm sorry I brought Daniel here. I was just so blown away when I saw what he could do. It was like a real miracle. I, I thought I'd... I'd found my faith again. Instead, I... I just heard him. Hmm. The Let's freaking make right. this right. We just have to get Daniel out of here. I hope so. And I'll get my sister to a hospital. Have her treated. I hope they'll help her. Um, Better care than here, freaking definitely. Anything would be better than here. Right. I just hope they can still cure her. Sean, are you there? <sighs> What's up? This guy is dangerous, Sean. Trust me. Hmm. Hey, I have a good plan to get him out of your way. He'll give you more time. Just give me the word. Okay. Yeah. Only thing we'll see what you can do. I will. Get ready. Sean, we gotta hide. Now. Well, I guess this freaking cupboard here, or the or the closet. Hurry up. Hmm. Closet. Then we can see. Come on, Sean, we need to hide. I'm freaking hidden. Man, if he finds us here, we're screwed. What are you doing? Um. Do we have to hide where we can both fit, maybe? Okay, we can't hide in the cupboard anyway. Oh no. Oh no. What are you doing here, punk? Huh? Stop! Let him go, Nicholas! Ah! Trespassing too, you little fag. You were always trouble. I'll deal with you later. Now come with me, you shithead. I think I've messed up. I think it was only me that was meant to hide. Oh no, because it was him, yeah, because he was trespassed as well. Why the hell, when I went in the thing, did he not come in with me? Vessel. Speak to me. <sighs> Reverend! Sean, what's going on? <sighs> Reverend, he was going through your stuff in your office. Jacob let him in, but I took care of that Judas. Oh, Sean. Little lost lamb. 
How could you desecrate holy land? Sean! You okay? Huh? Yeah. Don't worry. Come with me, Daniel. We're leaving. What? No. I'm not going anywhere. She's full of shit, dude. And she's using you. Daniel has made his choice, Sean. But I'm offering you to join us again. Put your faith no in me. No absolute freaking way. And we'll be family. Never. So that's your final decision. May the Lord have mercy on your lost May the Lord have nothing on it's me. It's time for you to leave our sanctuary. Right now. No, no I'm good. I'm staying here. Didn't you hear exactly. the Reverend? Nicholas. Sean is You really think beating up a freaking teenager is going to be good? You're in a freaking church, for God's sake, bro. I'm not going anywhere. This is my home. She's my family now. Daniel. Listen. She's not your family. Sean? Who is she? Our mother. She came here. Exactly. I freaking knew it as oh, soon as he knew. Praise the Lord. Another miracle at our church. Wonderful. <laughs> it's all right, Daniel. Go see her. I mean, she's right there. Don't be afraid. I... I don't know her. Of course. I know. This is hard for you, my son. Stop calling him that. You're just manipulating him, you sicko. <laughs> That's in the eye of the beholder. But since you are his mother, let me ask you. How could you let your child wander alone in the wilderness? Where were you when Daniel was lost? Where? Listen. Daniel. She didn't even freaking know. I came here as soon as I found out you were here on your own. I'm not on my own. Children are a gift from the Lord. They are a reward from him. You were blessed with a divine gift. And you cast him out into the world. Who the hell are you? You might have been his mother once. But when you abandoned him, you also gave up your rights. Isn't your God all about forgiveness? You have no idea what the Bible says. How can you pretend to care about these two children? You left them and your husband to seek out your base desires. Daniel, How is she honey, freaking she's trying to trick you. Please think by yourself. You're smarter than this. Daniel, she's responsible for what happened to your father. You don't know anything. It was an accident. That's what this well, world is about. Freaking Karen accident was not even there. Justice, pain. She's probably the I'm furthest so person sorry, away to actually Daniel. have been her to cause it. What was I saying then? Did I that make any sense? Probably I not. I hurt you and your brother by leaving. I know that's not enough, but I hope we can talk about this together that's what i've been trying to tell your brother and i'm so glad he listened you gotta trust us she's using you for her selfish desires daniel this time the choice is yours are you going to believe her or me i uh, i that's oh right. he doesn't know now you can't tempt Daniel from this garden. He'll stay with I mean, before, us. when it was just He's Sean, he was like, I'm staying here, but now he doesn't and know. And we'll never leave him. Go to hell. Come on, Daniel. No! Ugh. Oh, God. Oh, okay, what now? Don't you understand? This is over, Sean. You have to talk to him. You can convince It's the freaking him. devil with that I won't power. I leave you, Daniel. Not here. Don't be so stubborn, Sean. Your brother chose his path. Your friend, Sarah Lee, she's very sick. And Lisbeth won't take her to a doctor. What? She wouldn't do this that. This is pointless. Daniel knows who to trust. Hmm. I'm gonna say that one. She's not a real Christian. 
Think about Claire and Stephen. The more bad things I can say about her, the better at this point. They would never endanger a little girl's life like that. But uh, she's always Very right. Very freaking true. Why would she lie? Have faith in me, Daniel. Is I that literally all you can say? <laughs> You're God, just saying the thing, same thing you. over and over again. And to you. Yes, you said that freaking before. Oh yes, this is a toxic community. Hell freaking yes. She's cutting freaking freaking 2019 world. memes into this. Keeping things secret. She wants to keep you to herself. At least I can show my power out here. Show how strong I am. And no one is Before the freaking police find out. You found your home here, Daniel. Don't let him trick you. To just saying the things I'm saying about you back to me. <laughs> oh, what would Dad say? Oh what do you think Dad yes, would say if he saw that's us good. Right now, he wanted us to stick together. I don't know. That is very good. I want you to stay, but I'm not ready, Sean. I kind of want the Dad to just appear now. I think that'd be freaking amazing See if the Dad just done. appears. Hey, Nano. Uh, oh, it's burning oh. down. No one. I, I freaking hate that guy. If that guy can just leave, that'd I be great. Stop. Can we just code him out of the game? He is so freaking annoying. Don't. Why have we got the squad jumper back on? I thought we'd put on a loose, fresh set of clothes. I came all this way for you, and nobody will stop me. I'll Come on. I swear to God, if you don't punch him in the face, you. then that's it. Sean! He must learn. They are going against literally everything. Okay, spam clip. Cool. Listen, I know I wasn't a great brother. I was an asshole. I should have never agreed to do that heist. It was stupid. Sean, don't listen to him. He, he left you just like that harlot did. Shut him up. He can hit me. When did I freaking leave him? I won't give up on you. Don't hit him. Don't let them do that, Daniel. <laughs> He's doing this on purpose because he knows it's going to get a reaction from Daniel. Of course they're going to freaking get up. I absolutely hate seeing him like this, but he knows it's going to get a reaction from Daniel. In Seattle. That would get us pizza and snacks. This is really clever. Then pick the movie because we would always fight about it. And he always picked your movie. But I can't do that. All I can do now is fight. Quiet! What are you waiting for? We're the best team in Anno. Stop so it! We have to keep going no. forward. What are You're you gonna doing? kill him? Please! He's my brother! You can burn down our church, but not our faith. You're really Daniel doing it You're in spite of me, even though Daniel's telling Don't you not to. Up. <laughs> no freaking giving up, Karen. No way in hell am I giving up. Nothing, nothing is going to stop me, Daniel. We're brothers. I know. Dad always said our blood link was the most important thing. You know. Uh, please, uh, stop. Uh, Leave him alone. Daniel. Why are we Listen not freaking fighting him. back? Get up again. Hell yes. As long as there is that freaking left mouse button click on the screen there, I will stop. freaking press it. No matter what she does. I'll come right back. Well, I that can't. guy is an absolute and freaking again. asshole. I could say words that I'm not allowed to say on this channel about this guy right now. He is absolute freaking idiot. You. I do too. And I'm holding back when I say that. Shut him up now. Don't move. Just stop. If you want to kill me. Oh yeah. What's God gonna freaking say about that then, bitch? Do it. Shoot. Don't go ahead. Shoot me in the face and live with it. Now! Exactly. Freaking live with the fact that you've just shot a 17 slash 18 year old kid. There we go. That's why I wanted to freaking happen. Now shoot him in the face. If there was an option to do that, I'd freaking do it straight away. I'm sorry. There we go. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the best freaking part of this game so far. She was Man, that was good. I'm sorry. Sean, 
We need to get out of here. Now. Oh, no. No. You started this fire. You will all burn in this hell. What are you gonna freaking do? Sean. Exactly. Wait, Daniel. She really did try to use me. She hurt you. There's gonna be a choice now, isn't there? Ah! It's gonna be kill or don't kill. Oh, I don't know what to do. Yes, exactly. I freaking knew it. That's how much I know this game. Oh. Oh, what do I do? Oh, how much I wish I could freaking end the episode now, but I know for a fact that there's about 15 minutes left. I'm going to spare her. I don't want to be that guy. Couldn't get blessed with a freaking crap about the other guy. She manipulates everyone. Shoot the other guy in the freaking face before we leave. Is he just going to do it anyway? Oh. Shoot, Lisbeth! Oh, God! So, either way, she freaking dies! It means that she doesn't suffer. So, I'm gonna do this one. I don't know whether that was the right choice or not. It's the right choice for Daniel's perspective. It was good just to get the gun out of the way as well. Especially if the other guy uh, stood up again, then maybe he could have got the gun and shot one of us or shot her. I don't know what would have happened. I don't know whether that would be a drastic turn. Like if we didn't pick up the gun, he would shoot Daniel and then he'd die or something like that. I don't think the game would do that, but... That's the best option. I freaking hope anyway, like Jesus Christ. That was amazing. That was freaking incredible. This is the best ending to a Life is Strange episode yet. That's freaking all of them. Seeing as I don't know the ending to pretty much all of the first game. I think it's muted now because it's copyrighted music. So if I remember, then I'll add some uh, music in. There we go. Is it going to freaking explode? Cool guys don't look at explosions? Maybe? I mean, not now, because we're still technically within the radius. God, that's freaking cool. That reminds me of Far Cry 5. That's when they burnt down the church. Or was that New Dawn? I can't remember. One of them. Oh, no. I freaking knew it. He doesn't have the gun, though. Oh, Sean, go on. Freaking go on. I wish you had the gun still. The hell? Okay, we're back here then. So we got the sister out, which is nice. I guess they go on, do whatever they're going to do. And then we stay together. So I guess Karen is with us now then. So she's going to be with us potentially for episode five as well. So they're going to go off, go back to wherever they were at. I'm just happy we got freaking Daniel back. We need to do something about that hair though before the next episode. Get back to freaking Daniel we all know and love from episode one, two and three. There we go. I guess this is the end. Oh, lovely. Nice way to end it. Kind of wanted to see the church freaking explode, though, when the other guy die as well, but... Still, there we go. And then it fades to black.
And this is it. We made it, Daniel. What do we do now? Make our way across. You ready? Yeah. I think. <laughs>